Hey, Bobby here with Goods Galore Overstock, and we're gonna do another kitchen review. Today, we're gonna to have the EcoX Gear Boulder, and we're gonna have the EcoX Gear Rome 100. Please, subscribe and ding that bell so you don't miss any of our videos. And while you're at it, leave me a comment down there and let me know which one you think is gonna be the best one for the on-the-go person. So today, we have a review of the Eco X Gear speakers. We have the big boulder, and we have the little Eco Gear Rome, Rome 100. What we're gonna do is we're gonna review both of these to see which one's more portable, which one's better. Uh, in my opinion, which one's gonna be better if you're going to the beach, if you're going to a party. So up first, we're gonna go with the big boy. We're gonna go with the Eco Gear Boulder. Now, I was doing some reading on this thing, and it tells me I can throw this in a pool, I can throw it in the lake, I can throw it, if it falls off the boat in the water, it's gonna float and still work. It is 100% waterproof. Now, this thing is very, very portable. You got your handle, it'll take you on the go wherever you want. It's got wheels on it for easy transportation. Not a big deal. I think it's super cool. What it has here on the side, we have um, your bottle opener, which is awesome for parties. That's by far super cool. Um, and you have a pouch right here. Now, typically in the pouch, these are supposed to come with a waterproof case for your phone. But how we get stuff on our Overstock store, this came to us off a sporting goods pallet out of Texas called Academy. They were the sporting goods store that we got this Overstock stuff from. So when you buy Overstock, you tend to miss some things. You also got two cup holders right here on the top. Not bad. When you're at the beach, finding a place to put your drink, it's kind of tough sometimes. If the speaker's blasting, full blast and everything else, and your drinks are up here, it might vibrate out some of your liquids, but it's a good thing it's waterproof. So we're gonna put that one to the test later. Uh, this has a three-way tweeter speaker right here for your highs. It's got a subwoofer right here and a subwoofer in the rear. Uh, I believe there are eight inch subwoofers and three inch tweeters on that. So it's gonna give you good sound with a lot of bass. With two speakers for bass, uh, mid-range eight inch, your tweeter for your highs and an eight inch sub in the back. That's why it's heavy, but you're gonna get a lot of sound out of this thing. It's supposed to have 10 hours of runtime at full volume. You got your, these are actually waterproof, so they twist in to pull out. And they got your little rings around it, so it is waterproof, so they say. We have your jacks in here, so you got a microphone jack if you wanna start screaming at everybody. There you go. You wanna sing some karaoke, sing along with a song, plug your microphone in, and you're all about it. USB out, you have your Bluetooth hookup, and you have an auxiliary port. So you can hook up all your gadgets to it, whatever you need to play your music. And you can also do it via Bluetooth. Down on the bottom port is right here is where you have your charger. Down here, you can charge it. You can leave it plugged in and play it while it's plugged in, or you charge it and then you're on the go. Fully charged, ready to go, see you later. Let's go to the party, to the boat, to wherever you gotta take this thing, it'll go. This thing also has, it has voice assist. You can turn it on. If you don't like the song that's playing, next song, things like that without even touching your phone, it'll give you the voice assist plugged right into your phone, which is super awesome. It has presets as well. It has the radio function on it. So wherever you are, if you wanna program the radio stations that you like, you can preset them so it's faster search and you can find your favorite song a lot faster. There's five different presets in here. It also gives you obviously your Bluetooth option. The buttons on the top can do skip this song, skip that song, go back, fast forward, rewind, whatever you need it to do. 
it can do it. It also has the EQ system in it. You can change your volumes of treble, your bass, your mids. If you like something screaming really loud, you turn your treble all the way up. If you like to hear the bass, turn your bass all the way up. Or if you're just an easier listen, put it all right in the middle and sit back, sip your wine and enjoy the song. I think this thing is a super cool machine. Awesome for on the go. This machine right here, this speaker system would be awesome if you're gonna go on a boat, if you're gonna go to a house party, just because of the fact of how big it is, how heavy it is, and how you have to transport it, it takes up a lot of space. So I wouldn't be too versed to take it with me everywhere I go to have a party. Tailgating, you wanna be the loudest one at the tailgate, this is the speaker for you. So right now we're gonna turn this bad boy on and see what we got. Speaker Holy on, ready to connect. Connection successful. Oh, it's already tied into my Bluetooth. I tried it earlier to make sure it all works and I didn't uh, flub too much here on this. Let's see, it's already connected. Hook it up to Pandora. I can swallow a bottle of alcohol in a feel like Godzilla. Better hit the deck like the cartilla. My whole squad's in here walking. Volume's all the way up on my phone right now. That's the way you always want to do it with Bluetooth. Turn the volume all the way up on your phone. So you can control the volume via the master on the speaker. Volume goes up to 30 on this thing. So you're gonna have some good sound coming out of this. It's not gonna distort the speakers when it's on full blast. You just heard it was on full blast, but you didn't hear any distortion, uh, anything bad like that. Let's try a different song, more of a poppy song. While that's going, I'm gonna get some, uh, gonna get some water and see if we can shake some fluid out of this thing. Ah, well, yeah, I filled the glass up, but I don't think it's gonna shake it out, to be honest. What's wrong? You've been asking, but I don't have an answer. How come? I'm still thinking, let's pretend to fall asleep now. When we get old, will we regret this? Too young to think about all that shit. So because it does have Bluetooth, you can actually talk on your phone through this thing, which is pretty cool with the Google, with the voice assist and everything else. Now, I was really, really hoping that it was gonna have enough bass to shake this water and start spilling it everywhere, but the bass isn't as strong as I thought it was gonna be. But in the end, that's actually still a good thing because once you start getting speakers too much bass, then you're gonna get that distortion and it's not gonna sound that good and it's not gonna be as loud as you'd like it and still understand the words. The Eco X Gear Boulder, I think is enough awesome awesome speaker for your local parties that to me because of the size and bulkiness is the reason why i would keep it small on the travel so you can keep it compact you can hide it away when you got to go into any venue or anything like that i'm a fan of it i think it's awesome to rock out in the backyard move it around there's not a whole lot to it not very technical and I like to just plug and play and go. I don't change too many settings. This is super simple to use. It gives you the options to do your presets, your radios and things like that, which is also awesome and super easy functions. Now, we're gonna move on to the Rome, the little guy, the Echo X Gear Rome. As you can tell, it's a big difference. Super small, compact, it has two three inch, four inch speakers in the front and it has a passive subwoofer on the back. The, the Eco Gear is all about being waterproof and everything else. This is a waterproof speaker. However, I wouldn't throw it in the lake. I wouldn't throw it in the water. I'd be cautious around big bodies of water like that. Just because of the speaker on the back, I think you're gonna be able to get water inside of it and it's gonna ruin it. Waterproof, yes, water resistant, I would say so. I wouldn't say it's gonna float. I don't think it'd be a good idea to just go ahead and not worry about it and toss it in some water and let it float around and play music. That's not what this is for. This little guy right here, 
I think would be perfect for parties on the go. This, I think, would be a, a more ideal speaker just because of the pure size of it. Now again, you got your four inch speakers, you got your passive subwoofer on the back, super light, easy to go. Does not have all the functions that the Boulder has, but for a simple user like myself, I think it's phenomenal. I think this is awesome. Turn it on. You got lights on it as well, so you can jam out. You got different light features on it. The Boulder, the model that I had on the Boulder did not have lights. This one's got some light functions on it, which are kind of cool. I like it. What do we have? It's all Bluetooth. Everything's Bluetooth. You got your charging ports on the back. The runtime on this is 13 hours at full blast. Now, none of these speakers are ever gonna last that long. It just doesn't happen. Every, every music plays at different volume, different bass, different everything. It's never gonna last a full battery. It's never gonna last a, what they tell you in the manual that it's gonna last. It just won't happen. So on the back here, we got our input to charge it, auxiliary port, Bluetooth, the USB port. So you're still able to hook your items up to this, your phone, your, uh, nobody uses MP3 players or anything like that anymore, but you can do that with this. Nowadays, everybody's Bluetooth. That is more realistic. That's what everybody uses. It even covers the back to keep your dust. They're both dust resistant. So that's awesome. When you're at the beach, you don't have to worry too much about the sand getting in the components and ruining everything. Now let's see. <sighs> Bluetooth. I'm the B, the R to the double E Z, and down with my homie G A S N O E. Suckers cause I'm fatty cause they still be disagreeing. I don't give a cause I'm from F L I N T in a city where plenty runs slow. If you ever shoot through my city, now you know. Cause we a strictly business and we also got. This thing had an awesome little bass. It wasn't overpower loud. It was all the way up on my phone. It was all the way up on this. It wasn't overpowering. It was loud. It was loud enough to enjoy it if it was sitting on my deck to the back of my yard. It's not super far, but it's enjoyable. It's a good sound, good, clean, crisp sound where you're gonna be able to enjoy it. If you're on the go, you can bring this little bad boy with you everywhere to have a cool little party, to have a fun time, and it's compact, easy to hide. Now, I'm sure, just by looking at this thing, there's supposed to be some straps on here. To me, this is a good little chill out speaker. Now, yeah, they don't compare. They're not identical, it's not a versus, it's, it's nothing. I just wanted to give you guys a little insight of just a typical guy grabbing these speakers off our pallets, not knowing much of them, but giving you a, a, an everyday review on them. This, this one right here is a better speaker than the big guy, just because of how small it is. It doesn't take up a lot of space in my house. If I wanna play it in the garage, it's not gonna take up a lot of space. It's an easy, compact little speaker on the go. For me, kitchen reviews this is the speaker to go with. All right guys, for the quick little video we just did here, the little guy is my personal favorite because it gives me an easy on the go speaker, has a good charge time and has great sound. To me, at Kitchen Reviews with Goods Galore, this is the speaker for me. Now in the comment section, you guys give me a heads up. Let me know which one you guys like the best. But for now, that's it my little homeowner review for you guys here in the kitchen reviews thanks for watching guys don't forget to like and subscribe to our youtube channel have a great day and watch extreme unboxing on tuesday nights